What's up everybody, Travis here from Redwater Dodge, home of the $10 oil change, rig ready Rams, and now we buy your Ram and park behind me, one of the latest and greatest in we buy your Rams. This is a 2018 Ram 2500 Laramie, long box, 6.7 liter Cummins turbo diesel. A couple things we're gonna notice right off the hop. It does have the sport appearance package, which gives you- hey Everybody, we are interrupting your regularly scheduled program uh, with me, myself, uh, and Pam and Redwater Dodge uh, as a building and as a community to inform you that when we originally did the uh, walk around video on this beautiful long box sport Ram three quarter ton, you had a different front bumper. You see it was a rock guarded, somewhat paint to match bumper. And we've gone ahead and replaced it back to the factory Dwayne the Rock Johnson, solid color matched front bumper from factory parking sensors and your headlamps and tow hooks all fit nicely in there so there's no more rock guarding and bumpy little stuff it's very aesthetically pleasing so if you're more interested now than you were before you know scroll to the end of the video and get to the contact information and let's get cracking color matched everything including but not limited to front and rear bumpers a little bit of an accented flare door handles and everything along those lines speaking about door handles you do have proximity entry on this one also keyless entry keyless entry just means pretty much you know, push the button, it's gonna make some beep noise. It's unlocked now, but with proximity entry, as long as I have this on my person, it's actually magic. I'll push the button, it locks. Using a sensor inside the door handle, it unlocks. Just a quick jaunt up from that, you have your tow mirrors, which makes a lot of sense for a long box three quarter ton. Beautiful Delmonico red in color. You do have your cab length aftermarket running boards, your mud flaps on this one, Firestone, destination xt's on here that is a solid 20 inch rim blacked out no hubcaps or wheel covers or funny business again you have a little uh, bit of a accented fender flare on that one again it is the long box you've got a soft roll and lock tonneau cover on that one there we're going to take a look at the front we're at the front of the 18 2500 here guys you've got this uh, beautiful rock guard upgraded bumper from factory Dwayne the rock johnson solid parking sensors in there heavy duty tow hooks you've got your color matched grill inserts on that one lexan coated projector style lenses there you've got your fog lamps down below and under the hood 6.7 liter cummins turbo diesel all the horsepower, all the torque you would ever need to tow uh, whatever it is you're towing, your yard complete with house and garage or your neighbors if you're upset with them maybe. Um, anything you're gonna wanna do under here on your own without the supervision of a licensed professional is gonna be clearly marked. We're talking about windshield washer fluid, engine oil dipstick, engine oil cap, power steering fluid, things along those lines, battery terminals. These are fine as long as you don't, you know, connect them. Big booms. Coming around to the side here, More of the same Firestone Destination XTs, as mentioned. Tons of tread. You will notice a couple of uh, little chips on there. It's fresh, fresh unit. We haven't had the opportunity to touch up absolutely everything yet, but it will be done. Small scuff here on our tailgate. I mean, it's in relatively pristine condition considering the, the year of the unit being a 2018. It's like 2046 now all of a sudden. I went to bed yesterday, it was 2017. I woke up this morning, it was today. It's a bit of a gap there. I'm not sure if that's just a me thing. Maybe I need a doctor. Uh, again, bumpers color matched. Wayne the Rock Johnson, solid rear. Also got parking sensors there as well. Your receiver, your seven and four pin wiring, your backup camera tucked safely away into the handle of your tailgate. We've also got this ladybug that if it manages to stay there, you could keep it. Someone's actually gone ahead and installed the fifth wheel rails on this one. You've got your spray in liner, Truxedo roll and lock. We're gonna give that a quick little pop there just to give you guys a look at the fifth wheel rails. You got your wiring there as well. No excuses, guys. You're all, you're well, guys, on the interior of the 2018 Laramie, Beautiful premium leather interior. You have the leather wrapped dash, upgraded Alpine nine speaker audio system. The seats are ventilated, they're also heated. Leather wrapped heated steering wheel, sunroof on this one. Power driver seat goes forward, goes backwards. 
goes up, goes down. You can lean forward. You can lean backwards. It's got lumbar support. Apparently, we all have lumbars that need supporting, so we got you covered as far as that's concerned. You've also got two memory settings. You can save these seat settings for two drivers, whether it's uh, you and your spouse or you got one of those uh, special driving dogs. I don't know. Those are a thing. Um, you've got power folding mirrors on this one here in case of your garage is too slim. It actually doesn't have power folding mirrors. I'm magic. I did that without any assistance of any buttons. Uh, power door locks, power windows on this one. You got these beautiful wood grain inserts, Husky liners aftermarket, right? Someone's gone ahead and put those in there for you. This one is on airbags. You've got your uh, compressor pump switch and everything like that over here. Um, power pedals, 55,000 kilometers, actually 55,089. Uh, windshield will be getting replaced on the unit as well, guys. Again, it is a very fresh buy-in. Push button start. We're going to uh, turn that on there. 8.4 inch touchscreen pairs beautifully with your Alpine 9 speaker audio system. Integrated trailer brake from factory. Again, heated and ventilated seats, heated wheel, tow haul, exhaust brake. You can turn your parking sensors off if you prefer to live dangerously and you know maybe you don't want to be reminded that you're going to crash into something. Seems a little crazy to me, but hey, maybe you're a little crazy. That's, that's personal preference. It's up to you. Um, going into our touch screen here, you push the apps button. It'll let you unlock absolutely every single feature possible in the vehicle. Um, all of your climate control and comfort buttons, like your heated, ventilated seats, your um, climate control, is going to be available digitally as well. Um, you've got your media and audio uh, settings here. You can take a peek at your backup camera if for whatever reason you were wondering what's happening behind you while consciously driving forwards even though that doesn't sound in the slightest bit uh, dangerous there um, center console plenty of storage space a couple of uh, beverage holders there your nice little shallow console here's got some usb ports for charging an auxiliary port as well for audio deep console look at that you lose half of your arm in there tons of space in dash storage here additional storage here You've got 115 volt or 150 watt three prong charging port up front as well, guys. Power sliding rear window, right? Sunroof, look at it, wow. Technology, I'm really good at this stuff, it's crazy, can't believe it. I know where all the buttons are and everything, first try. Take a look at the back. Well guys, we've made it to the back where I just happened to totally on purpose, not on accident, leave the power sliding rear window cracked ever so slightly open. Totally fine. Uh, I did it on purpose. Again, Husky liners, obviously they made their way to the back. I think it'd be a little bit weird if you only got the ones for the front, but again, who am I to judge? Power windows back here. Again, this premium leather, the seats in the rear actually happen to be heated as well. And they do fold up for additional storage. Boom, you can fit all kinds of stuff down there. Listen, I want to touch on this thing. If you ever run out of diesel fuel, you're not going to be able to stick the tip of a jerry can in here very easily, okay? You need this weird little attachment thing. Don't ask me why. I don't know how it makes sense, but it's exactly what you need to put fuel in here, okay? Otherwise, you're going to be standing there looking all silly and probably spilling and making a mess. So you can have that. I'll throw that in for free. So next time you think about negotiating on the deal, I'm going to say, hey, man, I gave you the gas thing. You can also flip this out to create a completely flat surface, so uh, even more storage space than you would get uh, from the fact that you have a long box. It is on both sides. Um, underneath on that side, obviously, you're going to have your Alpine woofer. It's clipped in there, but it's fine. We don't got to flip it. We know what's happening under there. We're fine. Um, a second here. But yeah, a ton of storage space in the rear of this uh, crew cab as well. A little bit of storage space behind the seats. You can put all kinds of goodies and fun stuff here. Well guys, this has been our 2018 Ram 2500 Laramie Crew Cab Long Box Cummins Diesel. Now, if you know the marketplace, you know your trucks, you know there's not very many of these around. So if you're looking for more information or to make this one your own, you can give us a call, 780-942-3629. No fog, or your fog lamps, I'm pointing at the parking sensors. Freaking heck, okay, cool. You're, you're already set up, you're already ready to go. I don't know how to do that. This is a blooper now. Uh, not garbage, that's weird.